So we can achieve up to 40% higher feed rates in stainless materials. I'm here on the Göring stand at Emo 2023 and we're going to find out about some of the brand new products they brought to the show. I'm here with Gokman. Can you give us a little background on yourself and also Göring? Yeah, yeah, for sure. Uh, first of all, welcome back to our um, booth. Welcome back to Göring. Um, my name is Gökman Sanuk. I'm the head of product management. And this year for us is a special year. Um, we celebrate our 125 years um, of passion for cutting tools. And uh, for this special um, anniversary, we launch um, new exciting products. So one of this product is our modular threading system. Um, our um, flutless tabs um, combines on the one hand the strength um, and the durability of carbide and on the other hand um, the elasticity of HSS material. So if we have a deeper look to the tool, as you can see, um, the head is out of carbide. Um, it is an interchangeable head, so customers able uh, to change on site the head and uh, to use several times the same HSS shank. So that's the first tool on our tour of your booth. Right. And it's a great new looking tool. I would have liked to have used one, but that's a different story. Okay. So as we move down the booth, which yep. tool will we be up to next? Let's have a look to our milling cutters. We're a lot further down than I expected. Right here. <laughs> so we have two new members uh, to our diver family. You know, um, diver, if you talk about diver, there are all the features covering our diver milling cutters. So it is a very flexible milling cutter. Um, you can ramp, you can do all the milling uh, applications with this tool and even you can go for drilling. So we extended our diver products with our new PCD diver. It's a diamond tipped um, milling cutter specially for aluminium alloys um, and yeah here we extend the borders, we extend the limits. Um, as you can see on the workpiece um, we have ramping operations, we have drilling operations, um, everything for high volume cutting. And the thing, I'm looking at this, you've managed to get quality and performance because normally you see a nice finish, but it's only a finishing tool. Or you can do the roughing operations, but you can't get a nice finish. So it's great to see you've brought performance and quality into the same tool. Absolutely. Um, we meet this requirements and what I can say is nothing should be in between this tool and uh, its material. So, next tool, where are we off to so, next? Um, let's have a look again to the diver family. Yep. Um, the second member on the diver family um, is our micro diver. Now, I have actually used one of these. All right. And it's a great little tool. I actually used it in aluminium as well. Yeah. Um, we have a wide range of possible applications, especially in stainless steels and uh, super alloys. This tool performs really, really good, um, high performance. And we have with our Gyrojet coolant, um, we are able to remove the material very fast, remove the chips very fast um, from the cutting area and at the same time um, guarantee a long tool life. Because isn't that always a problem with smaller diameter tools in harder materials? Is that they can they break quite easily, your speeds and feeds are usually quite slow. So how does obviously you have the cooling section getting away from the chip, yeah. but does that also help with tool life as well? Because you're keeping the edge of the tool cool at all times. Uh, absolutely. Um, if you go for smaller dimensions, the main point is to um, have a most possible rigid tool, strong tool. Um, so also the position of the coolant channels um, are on the outside, on the diameter. So we have a very strong core of the carbide material of the tool and this helps to reach highest performance, highest feeds and speeds. Um, and at the end, this is the success behind our micro diver. Because I, would, I was just, sorry, as you were talking, I was just thinking, obviously, 
you see other suppliers with, with small diameter tooling with coolant holes through the middle. Yeah. But obviously that's going to take away from the structure of the tool and make right. it weaker. Yeah, absolutely. So obviously how you've done cooling is different and gives you a stronger tool for longer tool life and better performance. Absolutely agree. This is, this is the unique point of this tool. And if you look to um, several applications like here, bone plates in medical industry or in the electronic industry, um, this tool is able to, to, to mill in different materials with the highest performance. I think what's great as well is looking at your expression when you talk about this tool, it's even like you're in disbelief that yeah. this tool can do what it'll do. And it's your tool, which I think is absolutely brilliant. So we have one more section yeah. on our tour. Yeah. So if we move. Let's move. So which tool are we up to next? We are um, again uh, with our milling uh, cutters portfolio. And here we have also extension in our sharp family. So when it comes uh, to um, the milling, the application of uh, stainless materials, um, uh, we last year on the AMD show established our new sharp. Um, here you can find the best combination of carbide, geometry and coating. Now I just want to, before we go into the, the coating, Gurin is still one of the only manufacturers in the world that have your own carbide, is right, that right? Right, and at the same time we have also our own coating machines. Um, so. Um, we, according to the application, to the requirement of the application, we are able to find the perfect receptor or recept um, to, to achieve the maximum performance. So because you control the whole process, you can check every process and make sure it's exactly how you want it at Gurin. Absolutely, absolutely. So what we have here, um, we extended our sharp range, like I mentioned, we have here the sharp extra short. So it means due to the reduced lengths, we can go for higher feet and speeds because the tool all in all gets more stable, gets more rigid. So we can achieve up to 40% higher feet rates in stainless materials um, with our new solution here uh, with the Sharp Extra Short. And I know obviously I've, I've done a lot of stainless years before, which we'll not go into, that's a long story. But Stainless is always a tricky material because it, to get it the speeds is. and feeds right, to get it, the, the swarf to come off nicely and not be stringy or is quite difficult. So for you to be able to add 40% extra to your feed, your speed, which is also reducing your cycle time is a feat not many people could do. Absolutely. So um, we get away from vibrations. You know, um, the longer the tool, the more um, the possibility that we get vibrations is there. Um, so we try to influence the circumstances. So even under unstable conditions, uh, if we go for shorter tools like the sharp extra short, we hit the target, we go for the maximum performance and uh, this is the way we follow here.